celebrating 30 years of steel tube production at Salisbury. Established October 1989, founders Craig Busbridge and Ray Jack, alongside the Predella family, created the startup Welded Tube Mills. This business transformed to become known as Orcon under Hills Industries joint ownership, then Orcon Steel under Blue Scope ownership. Steel was one of those industries that never seemed to change and I think it was ripe for some changes and, and some new thinking and some innovations. Well, Ray and I wrote a business plan. We formed a little company called Buzzjack, Buzzbridge and Jack, and a, a mutual friend introduced us to the Predella family, namely Silvio Predella. Without the Predella family, Craig and Ray may never have got the company off the ground. Well, credit to the Predella family too. I think having the, the muscle of the Predella family behind us, they treated us far more seriously. And that became critical when we were getting supply of steel. You didn't just get supply of steel from BHP. It was, um, to, to get supply from them was a, a real honour. Like, uh, you, you couldn't just walk up and ask for, for supply back in those days. So oh, that was the biggest impediment to success. Yeah, and, and I mean, without a supply from BHP, we wouldn't have started. That was, that was, that was a, a critical point number one yeah. on their business plan. Once the team had secured their funding and steel supply, the mill imported their first machine, the RS90. Looked around the world for the best machine that would be easiest to change over. We met this company called Mass Soita. What we wanted was a quick changing machine and we got it. And it was Germany that built it. So it was good, a good piece of kit, a really, really nice bit of gear. And it survives today. So it just goes to show you, you know, that's 30 years on. The mill here that's uh, grown exponentially from its first starting period of less than 10,000 tonnes uh, back 30 years ago to be well in excess of you know, 150,000 tonnes now and uh, it supplies a significant part of Australia and, um, and the tubular needs. Today, all eyes are on the future developments for the Salisbury Mill. I think the challenge for us is to always be not only living in the moment of what we're doing now, but looking on the horizon and seeing what we need to be doing to be competitive and keeping up with what's happening in the industry. It's up to us to really write the next uh, phase of the business. And if we're confident and passionate about what we do, then we can determine where the business goes. This business should be around in another 50 or 60 years. We keep focused again on the needs, the emerging needs of society and just keep adapting ourselves, continually change and get better. We've got a great future. Orcon Steel, a proud business of Bluescope.